this is the dimension of pulley we are going to sketch this five groove pulley so keep note note down the dimensions let's start hi friends today we will sketch pulley in solidworks so let's start choose front plane sketch Dor draw a horizontal center line now start our geometry start from any one point exit select this point and this point same vertical now assign distance Ninety two point five seventy five mm fifteen mm ten mm thirteen mm Okay, now start. Choose line. exit from the line now we will assign some relations first assign this length seventy eight mm take behind this length little now make this distance 2 mm only forty seven mm this length fifteen mm keep height twenty one mm keep twenty five mm Okay, now choose sketch chamfer. Select three mm. Select this end, this end. Click. Okay. Again choose chamfer, sketch chamfer. Select one point five mm. And select this ends. These two ends. Okay. Now choose sketch fillet, three mm, and select this end and this three ends. Select OK. Now select one mm. Select this small end and this end. Select OK. Now our geometry is almost fully defined. So let's go for revolve boss base. The axis selected. Okay. Now see. Now again we will do some modification. Sketch, edit, normal. Now here we will create some V belt for pulley. We create some V grooves. Choose line. Draw a center line. 
and trim this choose trim and delete this outer line okay now make relation first select this three lines make symmetry okay now choose dimension keep angle 38 mm and the distance 10.77 and the distance from here to center line 9 mm that's it and this bottom distance 6 mm only this is what we want this is the actual our grooves choose linear sketch pattern select these three points lines reverse direction keep distance 15 mm and make five numbers okay choose trim entities trim inside portions select okay now see our geometry is ready just exit now see our pulley is ready you can see later we will assign some color it's still some work balance so let's do it now we will create some groove inside so select this face sketch normal now draw some center line vertical center line as well as horizontal center line exit now select circle and draw two circles one is small and one big i hope it is center assign the diameter one is 25 and another one is 21 select ok choose line draw two lines mirror this line ok now assign the gap between these two lines keep 5 mm ok now select trim entities and trim outer portion this inside also and select this side also that's it now choose circular sketch pattern select these three units and make six numbers we want six number select ok choose trim entities and trim inside portion this is unnecessary okay now this portion we want to extrude so select extrude cut and choose here through all select ok now see it is cut through all now select this back face sketch normal and here we will groove make some grooves draw a horizontal vertical line now here choose center point arc slot up to here ok now exit now do one thing select both the end points uh, we have to make relation uh, better select center point and the line and make relation coincide now it is in center point now assign distance center distance again choose keep 25 and the distance from origin radius 50 mm
the distance is quite less make it 100 mm uh, it's going beyond uh, we want actually ex exact to the center so select 70 60 this is also quite better or make 65 okay this is quite better okay now choose distance select this point this point and select curve and make the distance 60 okay now select extrude cut and choose through all select okay now see it is cut through all now we want to make circular pattern so just select circular pattern select this cutout and select the axis any circular okay and uh, we want three number of patterns and the degree should be here it should be equal spacing 360 degree see select ok now it's created and choose fillet select 4 mm and select this cutout Keep face 4 mm, ok. Now you can see this is our pulley. Pulley is ready. You can assign real view. Now we will assign some color. Edit material. cast stainless steel close now see this is our pulley cast stainless steel pulley i hope you enjoyed don't forget to share and like our videos and subscribe our channel for more projects and more more videos in solidworks thanks for watching